what's up everyone welcome back to another tech video tip video in today's video i'm going to talk about new windows update uh, which is 22h2 version the windows 11 update and uh, we are going to talk about uh, three new features of the the first one is a uh, system tray updates and uh, task manager update and also uh, start menu update so those are the three main updates they have uh, done three main changes so i'm going to talk about those in this video okay uh, let's see how we can get this update so the first thing we're going to do is to go to search and type setting and go into settings app in here go to windows update and go to win uh, windows inside the program and in here you need to um, enable inside a program in order to get this uh, version because right now it's not uh, released to the main pipeline it's not uh, released to the public so this is the inside a program which has like a dev channel beta channel and a release preview i'm using release preview because it doesn't have like uh, bugs and most of the bugs are fixed for the release preview if you put a dev channel it's like uh, they are developing on the dev channel then they test it out, put it in the beta channel and also tested by other people and it will put the release preview and after release preview is done, it will put the main release which is uh, the publishing to the public. So that's what they are doing. I am using release preview. You should able to select this release preview in here. Then afterward, go to updates and check for updates. It, you should be able to get the new 22h2 version of windows 11 for your machine so once you've done that let's go to the features so the first feature we are going to talk about is a drag and drop feature to the taskbar so if you have a pdf file like this you can now uh, click and drag and drop to the application you want to open then you can paste it here to open this pdf file previous version of windows 11 uh, didn't have this feature i don't know why because windows 10 has it and when you when the windows 11 rolled out when sorry windows 11 rolled out windows 11 doesn't uh, did not have this uh, feature right now they have added because everyone needed that feature i i almost uh, i'll use some other uh, third party application to get this feature as well so um that's the this feature about okay so the second main feature we are going to talk about is app folders so if you go to start menu as you can see i have already created some folders here previous version previous version of of windows 11 doesn't have like a folder a way to um, make apps folders so now if you drag and drop one app and uh, move across to another app it will create a folder as you can see it creates a folder and you can change the name here something like that and press enter it will create this folder this make this start menu uh, more uh, user friendly and you have you can group together what you need and stuff so windows 10 actually had that feature for not folders but it like a, we can group the application together so windows 11 improved it and put it like a um, fold like in like in android phones and uh, iphones okay so that's that's needs this feature is all about okay the third new feature we are going to talk about is the task manager so they have improved it and optimized the task manager so if you go to task manager you will see a different kind of task manager than the previous version of windows 11 so you have performance most most of the things are ui uh, changes and you have startup menu and uh, user control details page services and all those things now this is a really good because they have changed this ui to make uh, compatible with windows 11 ui so it's really good i think that's uh that's an that's the main feature they have improved on i think in here you have setting settings app as well you can uh, manage always on top hide when minimized show full account name show full processes these things doesn't uh, have this thing didn't had in uh, windows previous version of windows 11 so these are the new features they have added 
so that's it for today's video i hope this video helpful with find out uh all all three new features about windows 11 22 h 22 h2 version of windows 11 so that's it for today's video like this video subscribe to the channel comment on this video if you have any question see you next time with another video like this bye bye